Joining me now is former Congressman Ted Deutsch. He is now the CEO of the American Jewish Committee. Congressman, it's always great to see you. This is such difficult moments. Uh, how has this been for you, and what was your reaction to this? Uh, well, I, I was in uh, Abu Dhabi for a celebration of the Abraham Accords and a look to the future of greater integration of Israel within the broader Middle East and the world, it's the direction that everything was headed. And less than 12 hours later, we saw this horrific, brutal, barbaric attack by a terrorist organization that slaughtered now over 800 Israelis, 2,400 wounded, 260 people killed at a music festival, 5,000 rockets fired, people, terrorists going into towns, into houses, taking kids, women, grandmas, and slaughtering them or dragging them back to Gaza. There's a Holocaust survivor, at least one, a Holocaust survivor who's currently being held hostage by these monsters. I reacted the way I think any uh, person with a, a, a sense of decency and morality anywhere in the world would react, which is sheer outrage. It's what we've seen in the reactions from the president and world leaders. It's what we've seen from religious leaders and uh, and leaders of other communities. This is a moment to stand on the side of what is right and to stand against this kind of barbarism that uh, that's so dangerous, not only to Israel, but to the world. And, and, you know, and you have seen it. I mean, there have been uh, celebrations. I mean, you know, Iran uh, had a celebration on, on Saturday, bringing people out to enjoy fireworks to celebrate this. And, and there have been uh, events in, in New York City and in San Francisco and yeah. in London uh, and in Paris uh, uh, of people saying this is the consequence of Israeli action. Yeah. Yeah. I'm look, I'm not at all surprised that the Iranians are celebrating. The Iranians are supportive of Hamas. Their effort, their their focus is on trying to destroy Israel. We know that the IRGC, their runs come their country is a is a terrorist organization. So that's that's shocking, but uh, it's not shocking, still outrageous. But to see Americans in New York and other places celebrating acts of barbarism. What, what is it that's the, that the victory that they're talking about? Is it, is it the rape of women? Is it abducting kids? Is it going into neighborhoods and shooting people as they walk down the street? Like, who are these Americans who stand on the side of terrorists? Were there rallies after 9-11? Were there people going out when 3,000 Americans were killed? Which, by the way, thus far, just in terms of the equivalent, the number of dead in, Israeli, in Israel would be the equivalent of close to 30,000 Americans in one day. But on 9-11, terrorists attacked our country and everyone came together to stand against terrorism, just as everyone here should come together and do the same. It is shocking to me that there are people who would be celebrating the outrageous attack that Hamas has launched and continues to launch with the sole purpose of killing Jews. This is a pogrom. It is a massacre aimed at the Jewish people. It's who Hamas is. Uh, and of, of and I cannot believe that anywhere in America there is someone who would think that, that they should stand on the side of monsters. And that's what they're doing. Former Congressman Ted Deutsch, I thank you very much for being with us this morning. Appreciate it.